morning guys from me and emma hello <laughs> we are on columbia road we've been to the flower market we're going to get some flowers now actually yeah, definitely. had a coffee and it's such a beautiful day mm. <laughs> yeah this is really cute i didn't know this existed i know it's so pretty here yeah. good morning everybody it's tuesday today it's my holiday Monday, so I didn't really vlog because I said such a nothing this day. Um, yeah, I don't really much to say. I just hung out and chilled out. I've just been to the gym and it was like day then. And honestly, the stairs on the way out, not fun. Um, today, Megan is, my friend Megs is coming for the day. So she's on her way to mine now. We're just gonna have a big catch up because I've not seen her since Marnie Ray's, which is in June. Um, that's way too much time that's passed between us without having a get together so we're doing that and then um what else i've got um i think yeah i've got a couple of meetings today and then chilling tonight just so happy in a relationship with my sofa if i'm being honest <laughs> um, but i hope you're all really good i'm feeling much better this week last week was i just felt a bit weird and a bit off and i think one of you commented about me seeming sad and I wasn't sad I was just I was just a bit that way out like just a bit a bit flat and there's nothing in particular happening I was just a bit like oh, the emotions man but yeah all is well and I'm so glad it's a short week <laughs> good morning everybody it's Wednesday today the week is flying by and I am so buzzing about it <laughs> I'm just getting ready to go to the gym and um, I've had a very gorgeous delivery yesterday from Carolyn Hirons who is skincare goddess and she has her own brand called Skin Rocks and she in no uncertain terms told me that my skin routine was shit because um, I, I took a picture of a load of products that I've been using and she was like god I need to send you some stuff and I was like oh no <laughs> So she sent me a little parcel um, with things that I need and one of them is the moisturiser um, which is a, just an amazing all-round face moisturiser um, so I'm going to use it for the first time this morning and I can't wait because my skin feels very dehydrated and that's probably why she sent it to me <laughs> um, but yeah I'm going to use that this morning and see how I get on with it and then I'm just going to go to the gym I'm going to do um, cardio so I'm going to sit on the bike for a long time today and then do some ab stuff as well, some planks and bits and bobs like that. And then I've got a really nice day today. It's the Whistles Press Day, so I'll take you along to that because honestly, I've seen a preview of what's to come for autumn winter and it is unbelievably good. Um, the design team are just so good, honestly. And after working with them on the collection, I'm just like, oh, you guys are just, yeah, so good. Um, and then I've got a meeting and then Kim's here. So she's ho she's over visiting. So we're gonna go for dinner and then Lizzie's gonna come and join us for a drink after. So I've got a really nice day today. Um, and everything's just feeling really nice and balanced and calm. Like I'm really busy with Marnie Ray's, but in a, re in a, in a way that's so manageable because we've got a year to plan stuff. Um, and we've got, <coughs> excuse me. We've got so much in the pipeline in terms of new destinations and new offerings that won't just be surf. Um, so it's all kind of coming together. And I had a really amazing meeting yesterday about it. And then, yeah, in the next couple of weeks, well, hopefully in the ne within the next three weeks, we'll be able to announce our new destinations and new partners. So, yeah, it's all going on. Um, just trucking away in the background here. But like I said, because we've got the time, the pressure feels off which is so nice because I've realised that I don't work well under pressure, it just makes me stressed. <laughs> so yeah, I'm trying to get enough sleep and water myself and yeah, just really look after myself in the, in the middle of it all because it is a really gorgeous experience to go through and build something as well when it's not so stressful all the time. So I'm trying to really focus on yeah building it up and it's given me loads of time to do things like um, go to the Female Invest website and learn more about being an entrepreneur and all of the parts that keep it moving and the best ways to implement the tools and stuff like that so it's been it's been nice it's been like a nice calm journey and it, yeah it just feels really good and not scrappy like it normally does which is something i never thought i'd actually get to experience <laughs> but 
Marnie Rose is the saving grace. So yeah, it's been a really nice experience so far. Um, I, yeah, I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna put my moisturizer on and I'm gonna go off to the gym and start my day. But I'll take you along today, especially to Whistle's press day because you are gonna love it. Hello everybody. I'm just ready now. Please excuse the mess. I've just got ready now. I'm gonna go to the Whistle's press day. So I'll take you along there. Um, it's at the Strand in town. And then on to town town for a meeting after that. So I'm just wearing an Amelie Andor big t-shirt, some vintage little like kick flare trousers that I got. And then I bought these yesterday, um, some Onitsuka Tiger silver trainers, which I am really obsessed with. <laughs> and then a Mansell Gabrielle little pouch that is so easy to take around and means I don't carry loads of crap with me all the time. Um, but yeah, I hope you're all good and you're having a nice day. Um, I'm just worried that the end of summer's happening now, which is why I'm in a long sleeve t-shirt. So <sighs> we better just embrace it, haven't we? <laughs> Guys, this all launches next week. I am obsessed with these silver trousers. They are so good. I've got this at home, Anna. Do you know this? I've got this sample at home. <laughs> Boob tube. Guys, I've got a bonded leather jacket from Whistles from last season, which is the short version. And they've brought out a long version, which is very Buffy, Va Buffy the Vampire Slayer. And it's very, very, very cool. It's a bit short, yeah. Right, this is the bonded leather jacket that I've got. And then the main, the Mac version is over the other way. These trousers are cool. So whistles are gonna stock high in store and online and it'll come in at the end of September. Look how perfect this mini dress is. Beautiful. So good. Guys, this jacket. Yes, please. <laughs> How good is this jacket? So I got the I've got the trousers from what I wore to my Longing Whistles collaboration dinner, and they're bringing the jacket out to match in November. I can't cope with it. Look at it. So good. Guys, I am so tired today. This keeps happening to me about this time of day, like 4.30 or something. I just literally could close my eyes and go to sleep and I do not know why. I'm like not drinking coffee, I'm taking my vitamins, um, I'm exercising, I'm not drinking, I'm eating well. What else is it? All the, And I can't sleep that well actually at night time, so maybe that's what it is. It's not very good sleeps at night and then I feel like a teenager in the morning because I can't get out of bed. But I was speaking to a couple of the girls and they're all feeling really similar as well. Not having good sleeps at night and then in the morning just don't want to get up. So it's not, I don't like it. <sighs> and I need to find my concentration because I'm doing my female invest course now. I'm just doing it module by module soaking up all of the information i need to be my best entrepreneur <laughs> it's such an amazing platform honestly and they've made it really like cool and accessible too so it's actually a really nice place to be online um, and it doesn't feel stuffy or like you're in a classroom so i love it so much um my house is a shit show and i really need to t tidy it up because i'm going out for dinner soon um maybe that will pep me up some company and yeah I'm just going to have a cup of tea now and see if that helps me. Um, and in case you were wondering about the perfect colour of tea, that's it. That's it right there. Hi guys, it's me. I am ready for my dinner with Kim. I've not woken up at all. I feel full mouse mode right now. But I've come on to show you what I'm wearing. Um, I'm working with matches for the next couple of months and so... Very, 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 very lucky. Uh, I get some credit to spend on key new season pieces. So I chose this incredibly heavy, 
Uh, might as well be weight training. Denim jacket from Kate. Um, and it's got lots of uh, studs on it. And I think it's really cool. It's cut and beautifully and it fits so well. And I'm like, denim jacket for like the transitional season is like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling it. And then I've just put on a, uh, I've got the, I've had this for ages from the Frankie shop, like a, it's a super long arms, croppy t-shirt, and then just some vintage Wrangler black jeans. So I feel really nice in this. I also have some new shoes from Matches as well, and they're by a brand that is French. I, honestly, I hope they're French this time, because last time I said that Dres Van Noten was French and he's not. Um, this is Le Monde Beryl. I'm sorry about my pronunciation. Anyway, look how cool these are. They're like a little mesh ballet flat. I'm gonna pop these on now. Um, and now I'll be ready to go. Oh, it's a bit warm actually. I'm a bit warm in this jacket, but I'm committed to the cause. Um, I'm gonna walk away and show you. Oh, I thought just come out of there. That's good. Uh, yeah, here's my full look. I really like this look. Sorry about the mess everywhere. Um, these are so comfy, these shoes as well. But they're big, so if you, like, I would say size down, I should, probably should have got a seven and a half. I've got really big feet, so I'm between a seven and an eight. Um, and I got an eight because they looked narrow, but I think I've made an error because they just, they fall off every time I take a step. But you know what? We can absolutely manage it, can't we? Um, and then I'm gonna take my Mansa Gabrielle bag and this is me for a girl dinner. Um, and then we're going really early so I can be back and tucked up in bed, listen to my sleep stories and get me off safely and lovingly to sleep with the sound of Matthew McConaughey reading me a story about the wonder of life. Here's him. <laughs> everybody from a sleepy little mouse i am this close to putting the heating on what is going on <laughs> i've got a t-shirt under a jumper i've got my trackies on i'm freezing i'm freezing i don't know what's going like i've been sat here working and my hands are cold and that only happens in the winter like what the hell is going on um i really need to address my skin this morning it looks a bit and some waking up times I'm so happy this morning because I didn't get tickets to go and see Fred again um, at Ali Pally when he's playing next week. And um, I just thought, well, I'm just going to ask on Instagram if anyone's selling any. Lo and behold, I've got myself some. So I'm going to see Fred again next week at Ali Pally and I cannot wait. I just am obsessed with him. I'm obsessed with him. Um, and yeah, can't wait. It's just going to be the best thing ever. And Ali Pally is such a good venue as well. It's gonna be packed, I know it is. There's been a crane outside my window all morning, literally since like eight o'clock. Do you wanna see it? Yeah, great, yeah, they're just there. Just, just there, in the window. They can see me, they keep looking in the window. <laughs> I really could do without that noise. Really distracting, constantly. Um, what else? So, not too much else going on today. I. I'm gonna work with my team today. We're gonna to go to, we're doing a team gym session uh, at lunchtime and then we're gonna come back to mine and just do some work um, on a project that we're hatching at the moment, which is really exciting. And then I have to go and shoot something else later and I'm chilling. So it's a really nice day today um, in terms of like work and teams and things, nice things. It's not outside though. It's, it's freezing. <sighs> God. I'm this close to booking um, a surf trip to Bayreuth and San Sebastian. I'm just gonna go by myself, gonna hire a car and then spend some time in France and drive through to Spain. Surf, 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 surf. And I can't wait, but I'm just like, something's holding me back from booking it. I am waiting on like a couple of shoot dates um, for work to come through, but I could definitely do it around that but something's stopping me because I'm really enjoying being in London, but then equally desperate to surf. So I don't know where I'm at at the moment with all of that balance. Um, and I'm sleeping like shit. Last night was another bad night. I got two sleep stories in under my belt and then I fell asleep. It was maybe like 12. And then I woke up at five this morning and it just was not 
wasn't happening. I couldn't get back to sleep. So I've been awake since five. And it's just those moments where you're like, I don't know what it is, but those moments in the night when it's dark or in the early hours of the morning, when you're completely on your own, it's like every thought you've ever had floods your brain. And I don't think about it. I don't worry about it. I'm not anxious about it in the cold light of day. But nighttime, it's like out of control. I hate it. And then I just end up looking like I'm so tired. But anyway, we're okay. Things are good. Things are positive. Good morning, everybody. I hope you're all so, so well today. It's Friday, a short week, heaven. Um, I am just sat with my little eye patches on, waiting for Buster, my photographer, to come over so that we can have a day of shooting. I've got lots of projects that I need to get sorted. Some are video and some are stills. So we've got a full day back to back. So I'm just trying to wake myself up because, um, I didn't have a good sleep again last night. It was better, but it wasn't, it wasn't great. <laughs> and I even had a hot bath, read my book, everything. Fell asleep all right, but then just woke up a couple of times and was like, why? Why am I awake? <laughs> um, so yeah, just trying to de-puff as much as I can. They're good, these, actually. They're patchology ones, and they're really cheap. Like, they're, I think, about £12, and you get about... How many do you get? I think you get four packs. Oops four packs um, and they are illuminating eye gels, but they're really nice and really cooling. So I just keep them in the fridge for emergencies such as today. Um, but yeah, everything is good this end. I'm just trying to get the house in ship shape condition because I need to film a lot in here today and then I'm going to a Pilates studio. Oh my brain. Um, later to do some filming um, for free people with some Pilates bits. So um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna be such a nice day. But my bathroom's a right mess. like. Just product everywhere i need to sort it all out um yes and what else yeah that's it today it's just gonna be a bit of a mental one and i am um, i think staying in tonight really chilled what really chilled weekend actually you don't have many plans which is really nice i say this now and i'll be restless by saturday um but yeah i am just not doing much just need to work really hard today <laughs> and knuckle down get it all edited and sent over and then yeah i've got like a nice chilled um, time after that um yeah and that's it so i'll try and take you along where i can today um as we're shooting along but it might just be a bit hectic but i'll see where i get to and i hope you all have a lovely lovely day guys me and buster Hello. here we're just on to the last part of filming and um, we're going to studio anatomy the pilates studio that i always go to to film, uh, to film something for free people and have a Pilates class. Buster isn't going to join in, Buster's going to film, aren't you? I can do a bit of stretching. <laughs> I've seen your stretching, it's not good. My stretching is, is not good. <laughs> Hello everybody, um, how are you all? Hope you're all having a nice day. I've finished my shooting for the day, which has been so productive and lovely, and now I'm tired. <laughs> um, I didn't sleep amazing last night, but it also wasn't the worst, I think I said to you earlier. The noises, around here. The crane was here all day again today as well. It's just so good. Um, I'm bored, is what I am. It's Friday night and I'm quite bored. I haven't made any plans because I was like, oh, I'm gonna have a night in and all of a sudden I feel like I don't wanna have a night in. But I think I'm just gonna find a cookbook, choose something to cook and then put a film on and just have tonight in, go out for the day tomorrow, have a big walk, go and explore. Maybe I'll go to a gallery tomorrow or something. And then, yeah, nice calm times. It's probably what I need since I've not been sleeping that well. But yeah, I just feel like, oh, it's Friday. Where are my friends? But I also, yeah, probably need to look after myself too. It's a double-edged sword if you ask me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know what to cook or what to do, really. And I am tired, look at me. <laughs> I should probably just stay in, shouldn't I? <laughs> oh, I always say this, but I do wish I could talk to you sometimes and you'd be like, no, stay in, or no, go out. Um, can't make my mind up. Um, it's been, <sighs> better find something to cook then, hadn't I? I'm starving as well, I can't be bothered, but I cannot order a takeaway again. It's ridiculous, the amount of takeaways that I order. 
not all unhealthy ones or anything, but still, the laziness is unparalleled. <laughs> I think it's something about cooking for yourself and being alone. I'm like, yeah, I can't bother to order it. I'll be here in 10 minutes. So, no, I'm not going to do that tonight. I'm going to make an effort and find something to cook. Um, what else? Oh, I'll show this jumper is so good, by the way. It's like the best sweats. Sweat, sweat shirt, shirt. Can't even speak. Really nice, like oversized, lovely. It's so soft and creamy, and it's got little pockets in the side. And it's from Free People Movement, and I just love their stuff so much. We've been shooting for them today, and I'm absolutely going to spend my whole evening wearing this jumper. Um, but yeah, that's it really. I, yeah, I don't have anything else to tell you. I'll probably speak to you tomorrow, and then yeah, that's it been a, a nice week this week really enjoyed this week um apart from being tired not sure if i said <laughs> but yeah i hope you're good and you've got nice friday night plans um yeah and i'll see you later morning guys <clears throat> it's saturday today how are you all hope you're all having a lovely weekend um reporting from shit sleep central where again last night i was up i was awake about four times I was hot, I needed a wee, it was all going on. Um, but anyway, very happy that it's the weekend, very happy that it's slightly sunny and it's gonna get hot, hot, hot next week. So yeah, I'm just going out for a brew with my friend. I'm gonna pop into Reformation actually and pick a couple of pieces up. Um, so I'll take you along to that. Um, but yeah, happy, happy it's weekend. Uh, I've just got like a vintage uh, jumper on, St. Agony Tant, Tant, Tank with the hole in um, a bag from J Crew, which I love because it's kind of leather on this side and then suede on this side and it just fits so much in it and I bet my laptop would go in there as well. Uh, usual car hat work trousers, the boys ones um, and then my new shoes from Le Bon, no. Let's see. Uh, Le Monde Barrel. Barrel. I don't know, it's French, I, what are we gonna do? Anyway, I love them. They just, sometimes they come off my feet um, when I walk, but I've just been walking around the house in them and they feel a bit like more snug today. So maybe I just had cold feet, but I love them, like mesh ones, I got them from Matches. Um, so yeah, I'm off. I'm gonna, gonna have a brew with my friend Emma and um, see where the day takes me. I'll go, go to Ref and take you there and have a bit of a try on. Very good tank, ribbed, cropped. This is so good, guys. Yellow cashmere. Ooh. Do I like this? Do I look like Christine Regular? I'll obviously wear jeans that are like more high waisted. I like this. Ooh. It's good. This is a good cashmere cardi, guys. Super thin. Oh, I like that. Hello, everybody. It's Saturday evening. I've just had a shower and put a little face mask on. In my Backstreet Boys t-shirt. Life is really good. <laughs> I um, have had such a lovely day today. I was with my friend Emma all morning and we had some lunch and we went and sat in the sun for a bit. And then I went into town and had a big shopping day. I just did lots of trying on, lots of thinking about what I need in my wardrobe, what I don't, what I need to make room for and stuff like that. And I don't normally enjoy doing it. It's just, it feels like, yeah, it, it, it's just not how I like to spend my time. But I had a really nice day doing it. I was on my own and I just potted around all day and it's been such beautiful weather in the end. So I've just had some tea and I'm gonna watch Invasion on Apple TV. Um, because I started it last night and it's so good. So I'm gonna finish it this evening. Well, not finish it, but I'm just gonna have some more episodes this evening. Um, so yeah, I, I'm gonna sign my vlog off and thank you for being here. I hope you're all really well. And me and my Backstreet Boys t-shirt, we'll see you next week. <laughs>